This is the last video of the visualizer. In this video, we are going to learn how we can solve equations with the help of graph. Let's try to solve this equation sin x equal to x by 3. We have to find the total number of solutions for this equation. Now draw y equal to sin x and then draw y equal to x by 3. Both the graph intersect with each other at 3 points. So the number of solutions for this equation is 3. Now let's try to find the total number of solutions for this equation. Now draw y equal to 2 minus cos x and y equal to x plus 1 whole square. To draw y equal to x plus 1 whole square, we have to shift the graph of y equal to x square one unit to our left. So this is the graph of y equal to x plus 1 whole square. Now draw y equal to 2 minus cos x. We have to first draw y equal to minus cos x, which can be done by rotating the graph of cos x by 180 degree about x axis. And after that, we have to add 2. When we add 2 to the graph, the graph of minus cos x shift upward through 2 units. So this is the graph of y equal to 2 minus cos x. The graph of 2 minus cos x and x plus 1 whole square intersect with each other at 2 points. So this equation has 2 solutions. When e x equal to x, e x equal to log x and log x equal to x. Now draw y equal to e raised to power x y equal to x and y equal to log x. The graph of e raised to power x, x and log x never intersect with each other. So we have no solutions for these equations. But if we introduce negative sign, then all these equations have one solution, as you can see. Thanks for watching. If you want a video on any topic, then comment below or tell me your thoughts about this course.